What's the plan for today? The plan is we're gonna decide what are the top 10 foods in video games, like of all video games. So it'll be kind of us perusing through the, the entirety of food inside of video games that exist. It's Iron Chef rules. Taste the dishes and base them on taste, presentation, and originality. Once we have like our list of foods, then we'll vote on them based on both taste, what we imagine the taste to be, and originality. So the way we're gonna do this, uh, we're just gonna look through, we're gonna take suggestions from chat, then we'll narrow down our full list into a top 10. Once we have the top 10, then we will actually vote one by one and rank them until we have the best tasting and most original food in video games. Let's start looking up some foods. I just saw one that we have to do, which is the sandwich from TF2. I think it tastes pretty good because it heals you. Uh, okay, what next? God, there's gonna be so many shit. Okay, I'm just gonna go through these one at a time. All right, curry from Pokemon Shield. We'll do spicy sausage curry, which is questionably made out of Pokemon. Again, you're voting half originality, half on taste. Probably tastes great. It's probably pretty original to use Pokemon meat and feed it to your own Pokemon. No to the sausage curry, interesting. Skyrim sweet roll. Let me guess, someone stole your sweet roll. All right. Let me guess. Sweet roll. Someone stole your sweet roll. From Skyrim. Let me guess. Is that going in? Someone stole your sweet roll. Okay, sweet roll's pretty obvious. A bunch of people have said Minecraft. Rotten flesh in Minecraft. Is this one of the top 10 foods in video games? Okay, this is a hotly debated whether or not rotten flesh should go in. But if you don't eat human beings, it would be on the lower end of appeal. Rotten flesh. I'm sorry. All right, cake from Minecraft. Looks pretty good. Is the originality good? Seems like a pretty basic cake to me. Pandas eat the cake. That's pretty fucking originality. All right, congratulations to Cake. You are in the list. Oh, Portal Cake is very good. Cake from Portal. This is the cake, which is in fact real and not a lie because you can see it right there. Should Portal Cake go on the list? All right, Portal Cake. Great job, Portal. Okay, hold on. There's a few, there's a few other obvious ones. Dubious Food from Breath of the Wild, the description. It's too gross to even look at. A bizarre smell issues forth from this heap. Eating it won't hurt you though, probably. Plating and originality. It looks pretty original. Is this vote stemming from the originality or the taste? It's going in. Is Toad a mushroom? Like, is he an ed- What is his hat? He- mu Okay. He is a fictional mushroom humanoid. While Toad is the name of an individual, it also refers to an entire species. Okay, do we know if the hat is made out of mushroom or is the entire Toad made out of mushroom? And we, we can all agree that the Super Mario mushroom is a good one, right? The question is, is Toad made entirely out of mushroom? Look, in this picture, he takes off his hat, right? Implying that the hat is mushroom and his body is not. But there's a correction here. Though Toad has been seen wearing a mushroom hat on his head in the non-canon Mario cartoons, it was confirmed by Super Mario Odyssey producer that since the creation of the character in 1985, the mushroom cap was intended to be part of his head. And that would imply that if the head is mushroom, his entire body is mushroom. And if that's true, then we can eat Toad. And he is a food. I'm very happy to announce that Toad is potentially one of the top 10 foods in video games. We're gonna have to potentially evaluate some Pokemon as well. What's the like ice cream Pokemon? Vanillite? I don't know, looks pretty good. Peppered Slowpoke tail. They're the severed tails of Slowpoke. Oh my God, do you eat them? Description, very tasty. Okay, my assumption would be that if the tail of Slowpoke is tasty, then the entire Slowpoke tastes pretty good and Slowpoke is the food. Or are we saying that it's just the tail like a lobster, right? A lobster tail is the only like really good part. Is this whole boy delicious or is just the end part of the boy delicious? He looks like he's got delicious hooves. All right, just the tail. Slowpoke tail from Pokemon is going in. Okay, enchanted golden apple. I don't even know what this does because I'm terrible at Minecraft. It literally makes you stronger. Interesting. Okay, Nuka-Cola, one of the flagship products of the Nuka-Cola Corporation, one of the symbols of the United States culture introduced in 2044. Is there any information on the taste here and natural flavorings? The unique taste is a result of a combination of 17 fruit essences balanced to enhance the classic cola flavor. I don't know, man. It sounds like this is pretty good. Nuka Cola is going in. I think that's a strong one. Okay, Star Drop from Stardew Valley. I don't actually know what this is. It's strange, but the taste reminds you of your favorite thing. So it tastes like your favorite thing. All right, congrats to Star Drop. Jar of Bees. Okay, I'm not clear that this is a food 
for the record, spawns bees that hone in and damage enemies. I, I just don't think we can vote on it. I just don't know that uh, these bees should be in the list of the top 10 video game foods. I, I have never eaten a bee. F's for bees. Look at that sad little bee. All right, Maxim Tomatoes from Kirby. They are large red tomatoes with a prominent M. Okay, so presentation. We know that it has an M on it. Nothing really about taste, but we see the presentation, and that's pretty adorable. Man, it is gonna be hard to narrow this down to just 10, actually. Okay, Skyrim egg. Okay, presentation, fairly straightforward. It's an egg. Is there anything about taste? It's nothing about taste or flavor. Objection! Tiny from Animal Crossing. Tangy from Animal Crossing? Is, this is a cat. Is this character edible? This is a cat. Comes from her appearance. It says she's a cat. Beer basted boar ribs. If you ever played World of Warcraft and you were a dwarf or a gnome, you played this quest. Nothing my tavern patrons enjoy more than some beer basted boar ribs. In terms of taste, we know that the secret is in the malt. So there's malt in this. In terms of presentation, uh, I don't know if we can really, I mean, that's this is the best image that we have here, right there. Presentation seems fairly basic, but that taste. Man, this is a lot. There's a lot of foods in video games. Okay, this is for your consideration for voting. Okay, this is Hunter's Platter. Again, voting on presentation, originality, and taste. That is easily the best presentation of any food we've seen. So that was, that was incredible. They took Iron Chef and put cats in there. Damn, that was a good looking dish. You know what I loved about that? They like put the, they went really explicit on putting in a little sprig of whatever. We're gonna, we're gonna do some rapid fire. Sprunk from GTA 5. Sprunk is the like Sprite parody. Poro Snacks from Legend of Runeterra. Legends of Runeterra, look at that shit. A lot of people want Big Smoke. What is Big Smoke's orders? I don't know what that is. I have not played this game. Uh, let me get a number six with extra dip. I'll have two number nines, a number nine large, a number six with extra dip, a number seven, two number 45s, one with cheese, and a large soap. Is that considered a food? Up to this point, we've kind of had like one dish. I guess that is a dish. So this would be the entirety of this meal considered as a, as a single food. There's like 10 in a row here we're gonna do. We're gonna knock these out real fast. Ready, set, go. Super Spice Curry from Super Smash Bros. If you eat this, you start spitting fire. Presentation, literally on fire, not bad. The entirety of the Luncheon Kingdom from Super Mario Odyssey, which I don't think is edible. Like these are just walls. Slurp juice from Fortnite. Do we know anything about the taste of slurp juice? There are many Easter eggs in the game which suggest that slurp juice is made from toxic waste. All right, y'all, here is our list. This is just to decide the top 10. Vote for as many as you would like and whichever foods are in the top 10, we will then vote those down into the number one. Okay, congratulations to our art, our, our finalists. Cake from Portal 2, Toad, Sweet Roll, Big Smoke's Order, Nuka Cola, Enchanted Golden Apple, Sandwich, Cake from Minecraft, Slowpoke's Tail, and Butterscotch Pie. Wait, hold on. This has 126. Well, sorry, Butterscotch Pie. You got uh, fucking roasted, dude. We've got our top 10. We're now gonna move these into Photoshop and we're gonna start voting on the order. We're gonna vote and eliminate our top 10 one at a time. That's how it's gonna work. We're gonna start with 10 and eliminate them one by one until we know the best video game food of all time forever. To be very clear, you are now voting on which one of these you want to eliminate. Hunter's Platter from Monster Hunter World, you had a great run, but unfortunately, I eliminate Hunter's Platter, and we are voting on what is the ninth best food. Slowpoke's Tale. Hey, you had a good run, but you are the ninth best food in all the video games. What is the eighth best video game food? I'm very sorry to announce that Toad from Mario is only the eighth best video game in all of food. He was a good mushroom creature. A huge upset. What is the seventh best food in video games? Currently votes seem to be going between New Coca-Cola, Big Smoke's Order, and Sandwich from TF2, with Sandwich having a narrow lead right now. 
Smokes holds out for another round. And Sandwich from TF2 is eliminated. What is the sixth best food in video games? Big Smoke's order has been eliminated. And Nuka Cola gets eliminated just barely with Cake from Minecraft holding out for yet another war. War never changes. Number four, Cake from Minecraft. It's delicious, but not delicious enough to work. We're getting very close. All three of these could win. Easily. Easily. Your options now. Portal Cake, Minecraft Golden Enchanted Apple, and Skyrim Sweet Roll. What is the third best food in video games? Is Minecraft about to be eliminated? In one fell swoop. Te technically two. In one fell double swoop, Minecraft has been eliminated from the votes. Enchanted Golden Apple, you are the third best food in all of video games. I think the only way that we can end this one is uh, with the Skyrim theme. Now we are voting on the best video game food ever. You're voting on number one. This is not elimination, you're voting on number one. What is the best food in video games? Cake from Portal or Sweet Roll from Skyrim? What is the best food in video games? This is fairly close. This could go either way. It's only a few votes off on either direction. Which is number one? Cake from Portal 2 with a lead. This could still change. You've got 25 more seconds to get your votes in, and then it's done forever. This could go either way. It's 50-50. It's 50-50. As soon as the song drops, we're going. It's literally 50-50. Three, two, one. It's the sweet roll from Skyrim! At the very end, comes back with 285 votes! Sweet roll does it! Oh! Sweet roll Dragonborn wins! Fuck! We're all in on sweet roll! Get to the top! Ladies and gentlemen, I present the best food in all of video games forever! The official list, right here. Number 10, Monster Hunter Platter. Number nine, Slowpoke's Tale. Number eight, the character Toad. Number seven, the Sandwich from TF2. Number six, Big Smoke's Order. Number five, Nuka Cola. Number four, Cake from Minecraft. Number three, Enchanted Golden Apple from Minecraft. Number two, Cake from Portal. And number one is the Sweet Roll from Skyrim. You look like my English teacher, but less overweight. I am your English teacher.